Good. Let's go. Uh oh. Hello? Nope. Hello? Uh -oh. Really? Hey! We broke it over. That's kind of cool. Yeah? Yeah. Testing. One, two. Yeah. yeah. How the hell are you? Welcome to my nightmare. <laughs> Thank you. We can take a minute. It's fine. It's okay. Is it Tuesday yet? No. Okay. Then I, then I still got happy thoughts. I'm good. <laughs> Folks, I love this place. I love it in a way that is probably unsafe for my psychology. <laughs> or, or, or anyone else's. We, we built this as an opportunity for people to, to explore, to, to be able to perform maybe even for the first time on a stage without you know, missing out on the opportunity to have cameras and photographers and lights and get over this before you go and do a real, a bigger show, an even bigger show than this, if such a thing even exists. <laughs> it doesn't. It doesn't. But... No, there's nowhere better. But the thing is, we. So much schmaltz, I don't know what to do. <laughs> this, this place is amazing. And I, I'm a strong believer in going through this process of standing here strongly with a microphone. I mean, this is a cannon for spoken word to launch your ideas in the air. And if you're a singer, this means you're not going to miss a note of your song. It's all going to get captured. It's all going to get recorded. You're going to be able to learn from it. You're going to be able to share it with your friends. I think it's a big deal. When I started out this event, it looked something like this. Hi, everyone. Um, we're going to do a show now. And it was scary as hell. And finally, and I'm not sure who did it, but someone on our tech crew said to hell with that and put this microphone center stage. And I was forced to come out here in front of the lights in front of all of you and, and do the show same as everyone else. And it was one of the best things that ever happened to me. I realized at that point that my challenges are a little different now. I've done this uh, for about two, two and a half years, and my challenges are now to keep upping my game. You see, when people come up, this is the bar, and they either raise it or they leap over it like a freaking gazelle. And for me, well, it's that little bar, that little strip of metal that when I was nervous, you could see it on 100 videos. I grabbed onto this thing like it was a life raft, and I would, I'd play with the cord, <laughs> and maybe I... We do. <laughs> That's why we hold on to the microphone stand. <laughs> and that was the show where he died. <laughs> so, no, I meant me. <laughs> but I went through all of this and I realized that my challenge is different now. You see, everywhere but here, my job is to run over here and make fun of these guys and talk to them. Aww. Or uh, specifically them. Yeah. And here, I'm hiding behind this thing. And so we decided, especially after we saw some of how our technology went last week, we wanted to upgrade the game. And we've got wireless microphones. Now, that could be a great announcement if we wanted to. But what's a bigger challenge for me is now there is nothing between me and you. This is it. You're off the leash. I'm, I'm off the hook. <laughs> <laughs> and, and all I have to do is make it through to the end. And I'll be honest, that thought is a little terrifying. In about a month or so, once we figure out everything that we're doing wrong with this, we're going to let you guys have at it. And we'll have all sorts of new opportunities for you guys to try out new theatrical things without this stuck in your hand. I know everyone who saw our headset microphone and thinks, gosh, I want to look like I'm a, a member of Britney Spears' backup band. <laughs> I, I know you're really excited. All the magicians are like, yes! And that's what we want to give you. But for me, while it's a great announcement, it's also really scary because now I, I'm right here with you. There's no longer anything to hide behind. And I can't think of anywhere safer to do it than right here at the open stage. Welcome. Woo! 